Hi, I'm Tom Miller. Welcome to The Asshole Chef. Today we're going to make a leg of lamb. It is so easy to make, I could make it with your tits. Leg of lamb is hard to screw up. We're going to start it on the oven by caramelizing the fat after we give it a good oil rub down with some herbs, salt, pepper, garlic. Then we're going to stick it in the oven. Then we're going to take it out of the oven and then we're going to eat it. Let's go. <laughs> About a teaspoon of salt. We're making a rub here, by the way. So we're going to rub our meat with it. You know, a little salt and uh, some fresh ground pepper. All right, I like a lot of pepper. We're doing this rustic. Thick rustic. Thick, big, bold flavors. All right, let's rub our lamb. Penetrating every part of this beautiful animal's severed leg. <laughs> What we're doing now is we're rendering the fat. I gotta turn it down. Wanna get some color on it. Now, I'm going to pull out my meat, and I'm going to baste it with juice. Oh, yeah. I'm going to baste it with juice. <clears throat> well, it looks like some kind of stuff. Uh, and then I'm just going to put it back in the oven and let it rest. Know what I'm saying? Careful it's hot. Careful it's hot. Baste it. Basting it. I'm going to baste my potatoes. Baste my garlic. For all this delicious, delicious fat of the lamb! Fat of the lamb! Okay, so we basted it. We're going to put it back in the hot oven. We're going to let it rest in there. The oven is off for 15 minutes. What this will do is allow the juices to melange. It's very important that the juices melange. Rest your meat. Sometimes you have to work it, and then when you got it where you want it, sometimes you got to let it rest before you put it in your mouth. That was disgusting.